Leaf on the Wind here, bringing you, well, I guess my quarterly update at this point, whatever. Whatever, it's New Year's Day 2024, so Happy New Year's, everyone, and welcome to, well, 2024. May it be better than the last, although I wouldn't count on it. <laughs> so, welcome, everyone, and so, update on the channel and myself. Um, I have completed my move to my new home, and so I will be a lot more freed up going forward. I won't have to skip as many streams, hopefully, by the way it looks, um, at this point. I got a lot of stuff going up as is, well, going on as is a surprise of my, my daughter's extracurricular activities having a four-day event this weekend, which I did not realize, and it was a surprise. But luckily my sister's taking her, so life will be great. Either way, um, going forward with the streaming, we just finished up uh, Victoria 2, my Germany playthrough, which if you have not watched it, you should go take a look at it on YouTube there uh, under the live streams. It was probably the best Germany I've ever made. Um, even though it wasn't a full Super Germany, it was probably the best Germany I've ever made and ever done. It was a great playthrough. Um, it, I think it worked it worked out really well. Um <laughs> I mean, it's always a good playthrough when you ki you kick the crap out of the English and uh, release Scotland and Ireland and Wales and Cornwall. <laughs> so that's good. Um, going forward, though, um, so starting tonight and going forward on my Monday and Wednesday stream, I will be doing Anno 1800. It will be my second first playthrough. <laughs> Where I'm going to go through, it's going to be a lot of learning in there, um, as I, one, relearn Anno kind of thing. Um, but also where I, uh, as I look at it, I need to learn the 1800 mechanics specifically. Uh, that's something I really, when I did the first playthrough, I really didn't catch on as quickly as I did with like the 2070 uh, playthrough that I did, where I, I got that immediately with the campaign that they ran. Um, I understood everything, I just had to get the field layouts at that point, and that's all I needed to do. Um, with 1800, it seems to be a lot more, a lot more production chains involved, um, at that point, which makes a lot of sense. Um, but also a lot more detail in, like, how things are working. So the first playthrough is going to be a general just playthrough, um, figure, like, feeling everything out, feeling every, figuring out everything, so we'll just go on that. Then, on my Friday playthroughs, uh, live streams, which will be two hours long, we'll be doing Victoria 3, as I also get to learn that and all that good stuff in there. The key, the, kind of the difference is, 1800 I played about five years ago, I want to say. <laughs> God, yeah, five years ago. Um, and I got a little bit of it, but I mainly forgot it as I got into more Paradox stuff. Um, Victoria 3, though... I've played quite a bit of it here recently, and I think I got some of it down, but I am going to go through, like, the Learn the Game tutorial setup, and we'll kind of go from there, and we'll see how well that works. Um, and more than likely, what we'll end up doing is we will we'll be doing Vicky 3 on and off with other Victoria games, such as Stellaris and possibly EU4 and possibly um, um, Hearts of Iron 4. So we'll see how that goes goes, but we'll do the first Vicky 3 here, and we'll do the learn the game, and like the tutorials, and like the challenges, and everything, so we'll go through on that. It's good times, I will say. Um, other than that, Stellaris is on the menu to be done. Anno 1404, I need to redo the campaign, and then I want to do a continuous play of that. Um, I did pick up the historical edition to be able to do that specifically, and I recorded one video, and I'm like, oh, this is bad. I need to, I need to go back and redo it, so it is what it is. But those are the ones up for immediate stuff, and that should take me basically through January at that point, I would think, um, What with how, that's, how long those are going to be. I might pop in with some random games every now and then. I don't know. We'll kind of look at it. Uh, but otherwise, I mean, I would also like Starship Troopers. Uh, what was it? Starship Troopers Terran Ascendancy and Starship Troopers like Extermination or something like that. Uh, those are both games that are coming out that I've been looking at. Um, the, the RTS one, uh, the, I want to say the Terran Ascendancy, um, that came out. I looked at it, I played it a little bit, I haven't really gotten into it, so it's one I definitely want to get into. Um, and also Doc and Forrest have also talked about Divinity Original Sin, Baldur's Gate 3, 
um, and also doing Satisfactory again because Doc's been itching to get back into that. And I think we might actually get in back into that. If we end up doing that, that will not be live stream. That'll just be recorded and then I'll post of me and Doc being complete idiots in our Satisfactory game. So, you know, good times there. Otherwise, yeah, that's what we got going on. I don't think there's anything else. I thank you guys for watching the channel. I thank you guys for popping in. Um, it should be noted that basically all my videos going forward are just going to be live streams. Um, Anno, 18, or Anno 1800 will be live stream, but Anno 1400 will probably be a standard campaign setup. Um, also, still, Two Point Hospital, I completely forgot. I still want to complete that. I've never never got back into that after they updated it and broke my, uh, broke my save. So I might want to be doing that again. Um, State of Decay 2 also. But most of these were going to be live streams at this point, I think. And that's what we're going to be kind of focusing on. Um, probably some tutorials on and off, but I don't know. We'll see how that goes. So I thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you guys in the channel. Later.